Welcome back to the series where I test the old school RuneScape wiki's money making methods. And if you like these videos, feel free to check out the playlist in the description box down below. But with that being said, let's jump into today's video. Welcome back to season 8 of Test No Osiris Wiki Money Making Methods. And today's money maker is going to be crafting you birdhouses. The requirements you need to be able to do this method are the following. Most importantly, you'll need to have a crafting level of at least 60. This is so you can actually make these birdhouses. And if you're wanting to use them afterwards, then you will need a level of 59 in your hunting skill. And secondly, you'll want to have at least 3 million coins in starting capital. This is so you can buy everything we need to be able to do this method efficiently for one hour. And obviously, you will need a hammer and chisel in your inventory. But now let's go over my inventory. As we are bank standing in this video, we do not have a gear setup. For my inventory, all you will need is one chisel and one hammer. And for the rest of your inventory, you will need to have 13 clockworks and 13 U logs, as we are making U birdhouses in this video. For now, let's go over some information about this method. A U birdhouse is used to set up birdhouse traps. You can set these up on Fossil Island and this will require a level 59 in your hunting skill. However, they can be crafted if the player has at least a level 60 in their crafting skill. And to craft these birdhouses, the player will need to have at least one set of U-logs and one single clockwork, alongside a hammer and a chisel in their inventory. And if you have all of these items, then you can just use one clockwork on one pair of U-logs and your character will start to craft them. Each birdhouse that you craft will take two game ticks, and this is equivalent to around 1.2 seconds in real time. And once you have finished crafting, the player will then be rewarded with 45 crafting experience. After you've crafted all the birdhouses that you want, you can decide to place these in the birdhouse spaces. And these locations are on Fossil Island. I will also put a picture on screen to show you where the two locations are. And you can use two birdhouses in each location. And once you have placed the birdhouses, then you will need to fill them. And to do that, you will need a handful of seeds. First of all, you can use hop seeds. You will need 10 of these hop seeds to fill your traps. Unless you are filling the trap with a seed called wild blood, then you only need five of them. If you are wanting to, you can decide to fill these traps with 10 allotment seeds, and equally, you could decide to fill them with 10 flower seeds. And if you really wanted to, you could fill these with 10 herb seeds as well, and this will also require 10 seeds. But for the majority of people, they will decide to fill their traps with hop seeds as these are very easy to obtain and you can buy them from the Grand Exchange for a couple of coins. But after your trap has been placed and it has been filled with whatever seeds you decide, then you will need to wait 50 minutes before you can go and check your trap. And once you have managed to check the trap, the player will then be rewarded with an additional 1020 hunter experience. And finally, because a lot of players who do this don't want to make the birdhouses and they will just decide to buy them directly from the Grand Exchange, then this will open up an opportunity for players like us to make birdhouses for profit. And as of this recording, you can make around 200 coins per trap that you make. But as there isn't anything left to say, let's jump on over to the final price check so we can see how many traps we've managed to make over this one hour and then we can see how much money we'll be giving away in today's video. Subscribe to save this data. Welcome to the final price check of making these U birdhouses. And here in my invent is all of the birdhouses that we have managed to make over this one hour. Over this one hour, we have managed to make 1,768 birdhouses. So we go ahead and bring a calculator on screen. So for these birdhouses, we paid 229 coins for one U log and 966 coins for one clockwork. So if we go ahead and times 229, which was the price of one U log by the amount we managed to use which was 1768 and that comes out to be 404,872 GP. We'll go ahead and copy that number and if we go and times 1768 the money we paid for each clockwork which was 966 that is 1.7 million. Then if we go ahead and add on our investment for the U logs, our total investment for this video is 2,112,760 GP. So now if we go ahead and copy that number, then we can go over to the price check. And one hour of making U 
third houses comes out to be 2,531,776 GP. Now if we go back to the calculator and type that in, so 2531776. And then if we go ahead and take away our investment for this video, which was 2,112,760, then our total profit and the amount we're giving away in this video comes out to be 419,016 GP. Like always, that money will be going away to one of you guys. So now let's jump on over to the spinning wheel so we can see who will be taking away this money. Only 4% of you who are watching these videos are subscribed, so if you aren't already, smash that sub button so you can be notified when new videos are going live. So welcome to the spinning wheel, we currently have 11 entries and we have one new entry from the previous video and our newest new entry for this video is Mr. Man 2023 So good luck to everybody, if we go ahead and shuffle this a few times then we go ahead and spin this winner and it looks like today's winner of all profits is going to be it looks like it is going to be Spooky Tongs so congratulations to you, you are today's winner of all profits and to claim your winnings all you have to do is message me in game my in game name is brosrs it is the exact same as my YouTube name. But now let's jump over to the leaderboard so we can see where this moneymaker ranks. Welcome to the moneymaker leaderboard. On this leaderboard, I rank the moneymakers after I tried them and I split it into four columns. The first column is for the method I was using. The second column is for the money this method has earned me. Column three is for the order the videos rank in compared to the order I release the videos in. And column four is for difficulty. As if they are hard to do, they will rank it as red hard. And likewise, if they are easy to do, then I will rank it as green easy. And for any other methods that fall in between both of these, these will be ranked as yellow medium. This is for my medium tier. So today's money maker was crafting you birdhouses. And this net has a profit of 419 1016 GP. This was episode 7 on season 8, so we are officially over the halfway point of this season. And like normally, I rank this moneymaker as easy to do. The main reason is I'm pretty sure you only need like level 60 crafting to be able to make them. Um, there is a little bit of money involved in this, but I think at this point in the game's lifespan, a lot of people will already have more than like 5-6 million coins just sitting there doing not much with. And uh, today's winner was Spooky Tonks, so congratulations to you once again. And like always, to claim your winnings just message me in game. My name is the exact same as my YouTube name, it'll also be on screen for you all. But I hope you guys have all enjoyed this moneymaker, and if you have enjoyed please like, comment, subscribe, it really will help the channel grow. And I'm pretty sure this is the first video we have recorded since passing 5,000 subscribers so I just want to thank you all for the continued support over the last three years also comment some more money makers you'd like to see on the channel but I've been Ben hope you guys have all enjoyed nevertheless and I will catch you in the next money maker goodbye if you guys are looking around for your newest game make sure to check out cdkeys.com because they have the cheapest cd keys available on the internet for pretty much every game even new releases i'll drop a link down below if you guys want to check them out